My gas gauge came on. That's good. <laughs> my, uh, I had trouble starting this bike again. It's very, very possible. Maybe it might need a new spark plug pretty soon. We'll order another, another plug for it. That's the second time today. And the battery, <laughs> the battery is a little, you know, when you try to start it about five, six, eight times, the battery starts to get a little, shall we say, temperamental. Okay, would you drive the car right here? Well, we'd have to get that rock out of the way, drive right over here. This would be hotter than a goose's goose down sandwich. I wouldn't go any further than that right there. I wouldn't come in here. I mean, uh, you can see there's a lot of rocks here. I mean, I could. I've camped right here with the Jeep a few times. There's a lot of ants right there. A lot of red ants. You have to keep an eye on the dogs. But that other one is good. I like it. Yeah, when that fuel light comes on, I still got about three quarters of a tank. 30 miles, probably. It's, it was on a minute ago, it's off again. So it's right on the brink of coming on. Go to the back side of the lake on this. Well, good news. Uh, say the bike, say this bike were to break down right here. I would not be apprehensive at all to come down here with the car and the trailer and get it. Certainly you'd have to be on your A game. Like right here is real. <laughs> this is real treacherous. Yeah, I don't want to stall it out again. I, 
put the trip meter on. I guarantee you, there's deer hunters right here. Beautiful man, 50, 50 degrees in the sun, maybe 55 right here in the sun. Nice riding.